We always uh, focus on uh, new technologies. We want to develop more new technologies to, to give a, a better and better ride experience to all our end users. You know, in 2023, we launched our uh, first model with the L20. We use the bell, the bell drive. Compared with the traditional chair, first, the riding experience is very smooth. And the second, uh, compared with the chair, it's not dirty, it's more clear. Mm. But when the speed update to the 25, the pedal, mm. it will be about 80. For normal end users, yes. it's too fast. It's not so comfortable. Yeah. So we use about uh, more than one year. Our team tried to improve this. And as we find that if we can combine the, the gear into the model, it's perfect with the automatic transmission, with the bell. The changes of the gear is automated. Mm. The, the system, it can do by itself. So it will be very, very uh, easy for our user to ride. So compared with the traditional mechanical gear, so you can have more time to see or talk and to have enjoy your good review. Oh, yeah. I don't have to worry, yeah. worry about that. Yeah, 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 yeah. The requirement for the bell and for the traditional chain is different. For the chain, maybe it's 7mm is okay. But for the bell, cannot. It might be less than 1mm. It means that you're free. It might be 100% in one night. Our mechanic agent here mm. first need to fix this from the design and from the tuning. Second, the electric efficiency is about 85%. So when the, when the motor is working, it will have the heat. And also the automatic transmissions, it also is mechanic. So it, when it's changing, it also it will have the heat. Mm. So these two heat come up together, the temperatures will increase very fast. So if the temperature will increase, you know, it, the system will be not stable. Mm. But we still need to keep the size small. So this, I think this is very difficult. So our engineers, we use more than one year mm. to fix these issues. We design, I think it's more than 10 times. At last, we, we use the new materials, uh, new uh, design to fix this. I think the, the third difficulty is that uh, when we change from gear one to gear two, and gear two to gear three, and get from gear three, come back to gear two. It suddenly... Just switching the gear, and yeah. you feel a little bit Mm. Yeah, 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 yeah. So it's not good for the riding. Mm -hmm. So uh, our engineers, we need to uh, improve this. Mm -hmm. So we add more sensor to detect when we are changing the gear, mm -hmm. and I use the software to improve it. So we need to ride outside to test. Mm -hmm. We have uh, different kind of conditions to check this riding is perfect or not. Yeah, I think this three is the, it's the biggest difficulty for us at the moment. Uh, we continue to focus on the uh, bell drive because I really love the bell drive. So we were trying to launch the new model in 2026, maybe end of 2026. Uh, people can set the transmission by itself. For example, like, like me, I like the 21 kilometers to change it. But some people, maybe you, you, you went to 19. Then this can be changed by yourself. So I think it will be more smart. The second direct change is that we are working with the electric car uh, solutions companies. We are trying to use the some new technologies in the electric car to our e-bike. Yeah. You know, the render, they can uh, check the road conditions. Mm -hmm. Then, based on this, our control systems can do some changing on the software. Then, the people will have more safety riding and more comfortable riding. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is, I think, uh, this uh, two directions for new, for new technology we are focused on. So I think at this moment, the new technology for e-bike, it just start. In the next uh, two years, three years, five years, you will have many, many new technologies to launch in the market. Uh, this really a novel function that I haven't seen in other e-bikes. And we look forward that ADO can develop such a advanced e-bikes in the future. And thank you so much, Mr. Sen, today for sharing so much detailed information. And our subscriber, if you have any questions, just leave in a comment and let us know. And that's all for today's interview. See you next time.
you. Bye bye. Thank you.